Hey, this is Brett with Summit Auto in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. I'm super excited to be showing you this brand new 2021 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sahara package in bright white. This one has a 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor, which is gonna get you 24 miles per gallon. Yes, 24 miles per gallon on the highway, 19 city and an average of 21 miles per gallon. Uh, it has that 3.6, with the e-torque, so that's where you're gonna get that good fuel economy. This one also has the LED lighting group and the color match hardtop uh, package on it, as well as blind spot cross path detection. And it also comes with the dark saddle brown leather interior. So we're gonna check out all the options on this video, or on this uh, vehicle. And speaking of the video, we shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second. So if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device, turn them on right now because it is definitely your best way to look at the vehicle, check out the options, check out the styling, check out those headlights, and to see the color all before seeing it in person. And if you'd like to check out all the photos on this vehicle, in the upper right-hand part of your screen is a link to our website you can click that and check us out there. So here has come with the color match fenders. It also comes with the factory running boards on there. You also get the silver trim uh, throughout the vehicle, including the Jeep and Sahara logo. You also get the silver trail rated badge. This one comes with the 18 inch polished aluminum and painted granite crystal pocket rims. Has Goodyear Wrangler all-terrain adventure tires on here. These are 25570R18s, and they are definitely an all-terrain tread pattern on there. Like I said, the color match fenders come standard with the Sahara. Very popular option to do on the Sahara, though, is that color match hardtop, which is not a cheap option. You can see those LED running lights there, also the LED headlamps, and you get LED running lights in the fenders and the LED fog lamps. One thing to note on the Sahara here is the silver trim around the fog light bezels, around the grill inserts there, and around the headlight bezels are all that silver. I'm not sure if it's billet silver or bright silver. I'd have to probably say it's probably billet silver, would be my guess. But you get the Jeep logo and the Sahara in that same color. Couple little Easter eggs, you get the Jeep on the shroud here, you get the sandals, and then on the windshield you get the Jeep climbing up the side of your windshield, so kind of cool stuff there. Has the T50 indicators on the door hinges so that you know that the Torx 50 wrench is what you use to get those door hinge bolts out. Here's the original window sticker. I'm not gonna go through everything on here, but I am going to, uh, show it to you so feel free to pause this at any time so you can check out all the options to make sure that this is the one that you want has so you can see it is a 2021 wrangler unlimited sahara 4x4 comes with the bright white clear coat interior dark saddle uh, colors 3.6 with the e-torque eight-speed automatic transmission everything on the left here is going to be standard equipment so you got the backup camera the command track four-wheel drive system, keyless entry, uh, garage door opener, seven-inch Uconnect radio, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, 115 volt, all that stuff is standard on the left. Your optional equipment is the leather-trimmed seats, which are a $1,595 option, the LED lighting group, which is $1,295, the safety group, which is $895, the eight-speed and the V6, are $3,000 put together. This one does have anti-spin rear differential. And uh, the color match hardtop is $2,395. So definitely not a cheap option to get that color match hardtop, but a lot of people like it. So uh, that's why we usually order them that way. Total MSRP is 49,935. And if you wanna get your summit price in the upper right hand part of the screen as a link to our website, click that and check us out there to get all the rebates and incentives. 3 year 36 bumper to bumper, 5 year 60 powertrain. Miles per gallon, 24 highway, 19 city, 21 average. And that's all thanks to that 8 speed automatic transmission and the e torque system on here. 
four star front crash test rating and three star rollover. The others are not rated. We'll get back to the interior in just a second, but I uh, wanted to finish up the outside of the vehicle and check out the back of the vehicle. You get the four wheel disc brakes on the Sahara or any Wrangler. You get the LED tail lamps as well. Comes with that matching spare. And this is where your backup camera is. And you can get a good idea of that tread pattern on there. You do get a little Jeep logo on that rim. LED lights on the license plate and you do get a tow hook there as well. Back storage area is pretty ample. You do get storage space underneath here with a plug for draining it if you do get water back here when you have the top off. You also have spots for your door hinge, roof, and windshield bolts as well as the jack tools that are underneath there. Notice that they have all the bars color matched to the body so when you do have the hard top pieces off everything will look uniform. Speaking of those hard top pieces, this is the case for the front pieces. You have to take those off for, first before you take off the backs or the back piece. Um, three bolts on each side, two on the top, so a total of eight bolts, and then two quick disconnects um, to get that hard top off. And then you can put those disconnects right there. There's a little storage area for the electrical and windshield washer fluid. Those seats do fold down, which I'll show you in just a little bit how that works. The glass and the rear doors are just the same as the JKs. They've made these doors a lot lighter though on the JLs. And then they got this badge back here for wheelbase and overall length for the two door, four door, and water fording. Tells you where it's made, Toledo, Ohio. And these doors, they close a lot nicer, a lot smoother. They're a lot lighter um, than the old JKs. You also get the black finish on the fuel door there. And really like that color match hardtop. I think it's worth it. It seems like a lot of money, but when you're paying this much for a Wrangler, what's an extra 2300 bucks, right? <laughs> Anyways, blind spot monitoring, heated mirrors. Inside that dark saddle brown, I think is a great accent to the white on the vehicle. You get the Sahara stitched into the backrest, and it's almost like a metallic um, stitching there. It's kind of cool. Driver's seat height adjuster. You do have lumbar there. They do have side airbags now on the seats. And you do get factory floor mats. Auto headlamps, tilt, and telescopic steering wheels. So they go up and down now, and then they telescope out and back in. They never used to do that on the old JKs. You do get power mirrors, power locks, and power windows. Inside you get the seven inch LCD display. We'll turn the ignition on here so you can see that. You get the little Jeep animation on there. Sahara as well. You get a digital speedometer, compass, outside temp display. Um, and you can change those corners to read pretty much whatever you'd like. Just a really nice instrument cluster on there. You get the leather wrapped steering wheel with the nice white stitching. Cruise controls on the right. Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. And you do get audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. Before we get to the radio, I do want to point out the dash. So the dash trim is all leather wrapped here. You get that same stitching right there as well as on top. And that's the stitching, or that's the trim panel that they use for all the Saharas. They have a different one for pretty much every different trim level. The Sahara happens to be this leather wrap. My favorite, by far. Here's the seven inch Uconnect radio, AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. This is also where you can do your climate controls. Notice you do get dual climate control on this vehicle. And then you can do your other controls, which is just basically your backup camera. Take note how crystal clear that backup camera is. They went to HD backup cameras for the Wranglers, um, which I really like. And that grid line is lined up right with the center of the vehicle. So if you were to put a hitch on here, it'd be lined right up with that. And uh, like I said, those grid lines turn as you turn the steering wheel. 
so you can kind of see where you're going in the future as you're backing up. And then you have all your different apps here, including Android Auto and Apple CarPlay, where you can project your cell phone to the screen. So while this vehicle does not have navigation on it, you can project your cell phone to the screen. And if you have a navigation system such as Google Maps or Waze, you can project it to the screen. And then it's just like you have navigation on the radio. So um, pretty cool system. We actually did a demo on Android Auto. If you want to check that out, it's in the upper right hand part of the screen. So click that and check us out there. Down here are your more tactile climate controls, as well as a tactile volume and tune knob and your dual climate controls there. Start stop capabilities, stability control, parking sensors, you can turn those off, downhill assist control, and you can turn the screen off altogether if you want. Has a push button start, and it has the proximity key right here. It's a switchblade style key, so that key flips out like so. Really a chunky, heavy duty key fob. Um, you always know which key you have in your pocket when you get your Wrangler key on you. Here are your power windows. You get a 12 volt power point. You get an AUX, USB, and USB-C jack. Your command track four-wheel drive system. Here's your shifter. Four-wheel drive high, two-wheel drive, and four-wheel drive low, as well as a neutral setting. And then you have your eight-speed automatic transmission. You get the little Jeep logo on top there, the red button to engage it and uh, yeah that's pretty much it for the dash on these really like that once again that saddle brown leather you get the crushed eggshell finish look to the hard top pieces you get the quick disconnects for those hard top pieces they're easy to get off you get home link buttons standard on the Sahara these are for your garage doors, security systems, lighting systems, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. The one thing they don't have that the uh, old JKs had were these knobs that secured the hardtop pieces. They don't have that anymore, so it's a lot easier to get those off. Um, a lot of people didn't even have them in on the JKs. Anyways, so we'll check out the back seats, and then we'll do one more final walk around here. So the first thing I noticed on the JLs was the, there's more leg room back here. It's a little bit more comfortable to sit back here. You do still get the latch child safety system. And then the second thing I noticed is that these uh, headrests, they go down even when the seat's in the upright position, uh, which they never did before. Every time you'd put the seat up in a JK, that headrest would go up. Well, now you can just put the headrest down for better visibility when nobody's riding back here. And then the last thing I noticed was that these seats go down very easy. They don't rub on the back of the front seats, which is really nice to put them up and to put them down. You don't feel like you're going to be wrecking the back of your front seat. You also get two USBs, two USB-Cs back here for charging. And then you get a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in. Here's your rear window controls. Get some air vents right there, factory floor mats, a couple coin holders, and then you get child safety locks on those back doors as well. And that's pretty much it for the 2021 Sahara Wrangler. We're going to do one more final last walk around. Take note of the LED license plate lights, the LED tail lamps. And uh, I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you will have gotten a really good idea of the overall looks and styling and options on this particular Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sahara in bright white. And one more look at those super bright headlights and fog lights and running lights. And to see more pictures of this Jeep Wrangler, one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to that website right there, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left. A link to more Jeep Wrangler videos like this one on your right. If you have not been to our website, on the bottom, a link to this vehicle, 
on our website, click those, check us out, and we're super excited to be offering this brand new 2021 Jeep Wrangler Limited Sahara in bright white clear coat with the saddle brown interior. Thanks again for checking out the video.